Hey guys, welcome back to Diana Marie TV. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button so you won't miss out on any new content from my channel. So guys, today is the day that a lot of us have been waiting on. The Bulls play their first game of the season tonight against Charlotte. It's been 84 years. I am really hyped about this season. I have some expectations, and I really think that this team is going to surprise a lot of people. And as of right now, it is the only Chicago sports team that can give us a little hope right now. But what exactly can we expect from the Chicago Bulls this season? Now, I can do an entire list, and this video would be so long, but instead, I narrowed them down to three things, so let's get into it. So starting out at number three, the Bulls will have a reliable point guard. Going into the season, it was really up in the air who was going to be starting, and Boylan announced that it will be Sadoransky, which we all knew was coming. In so many words, the Bulls told Chris Dunn they were looking to upgrade the point guard position by getting Sadoransky in the offseason and drafting Kobe White. Sadoransky just fits better alongside Zach and Lori. He's a great officiator, doesn't need the ball in his hand to be effective, and watching him in preseason, it seems like the Bulls made a great decision by getting him. Now, coming in at number two, I could be wrong about this, but I have a very strong feeling that there will be multiple players on this team that will have a breakout season. I think that will obviously be Zach Levine, Kobe White, and possibly Lori Marketing. Zach has showed us how much work he has put in over the summer. He is one of the most athletic players in the NBA. He's speaking up more and everything he does is effortless and he's also improving on his defense. Kobe White showed flashes in preseason that he's going to be relied on when it comes to playing defense and shooting threes and he really fits well on the team and now that Zion is hurt he has a strong chance of becoming rookie of the year but Laurie marketing I said possibly because he did have a quiet preseason but again it's just preseason I think Laurie has all-star potential and I'm really looking forward to seeing what his game is going to be and see if he can take it to another level now I saved the best for last because I feel like it's the most important thing that matters this season and that is that the Chicago Bulls Bulls would be a better defensive team. The Bulls was ranked one of the worst defensive teams last season, but with the addition of Thaddeus Young, Sadoransky, Chris Dunn, who really shot on the defensive end in preseason, a healthy one, Del Carter Jr., Gafford, and a full season, Otto Porter Jr., this season will be different. More importantly, all eyes would be on Wendell Carter Jr. to see how well he can be a rim protector and if he's going to take a big leap in his second year with the Bulls. So that is it for this video make sure you guys leave your thoughts and your opinions below do you agree with me let me know what are you guys top three expectations for the Bulls this season and let me know what are you guys predictions for tonight the Bulls should win this game against Charlotte I mean obviously they need to win this game to set the pace for the rest of the season and their game coming up on Friday against Memphis that's another game that they should win they play a lot of easy teams at the beginning of the season except maybe against Toronto but these first two games the Bulls should absolutely win it thank you guys Guys, so much for watching make sure you are subscribed like if you haven't and I will see you guys in my next video